like you know, a very religious man had been elected leader of the Social Credit Party, the right wing um, government, and Bill Van Der Zandt. And he brought into the position as premier a very religious, fundamental religious doctrine. And, um, and so they said of ignorance or hatred, they, you know, these people are immoral, they're spreading this disease around, um, and, and instead of treating the issue as a health issue, right? And, uh, and so that's when the talk of the quarantine, of quarantining the uh, gay men came into play in the mid-80s there. And, and so it was frightening because, you know, we knew government can just create policies. They did it with the judge to mass the victims. So we knew that was a very real threat. And uh, so we needed to do work and be um, quite vigilant about that. And that was slightly before ACT UP started. And it was great when ACT UP started because that took off. I think the, some of the actions that ACT UP engaged in were great. So, you know, it, um, in my opinion, um, the Coalition for Responsible Health Legislation, we accomplished our goal mm -hmm. of ensuring no quarantine. And, um, and so it just, some of our members got involved with ACT UP. Mm -hmm. and, uh, and I was still involved with, you know, my trans organizing and my sex work organizing. So it it was, a, I think, a, a, a good little group, and it lasted for the period of time it needed to last for yeah. to accomplish the goal of stopping the um, quarantine.